Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. This is a brand new video, my Ninja Bun tutorial. So let's get started. So I'm showing you guys all the things you're gonna need. That's a rubber band, some uh, hairpins, and of course, braiding hair. Any kind of braiding hair will do as long as it's Kanenkalon. That pack cost me a dollar. So I already have um, stretched hair that I blow dried and I'm just gonna be brushing it up with my Boar Bristle brush. Just trying to get it really, really, really smooth. So now right here you can see me taking my Eco Styler and just smoothing up like the front of my hair and the back. Cause I don't want to put the gel all over my hair cause that's just too much gel and I don't want to deal with that. I don't even like wearing gel. So, but for this style you need their hair to look sleek and awesome. So I'm gonna go back in with my brush trying to brush all the hair up and now I'm just gonna go ahead and put my hair into a nice high ponytail try and get it as high as you can without the back of your hair falling out of it so that's what I'm doing and going back in with the brush to make sure everything is in my hair you guys I know I was doing my locks but I decided to take them out and uh, my hair grew a lot. It grew out a lot, but it's still in that awkward stage. So I can't do like a regular bun without some extra hair because it's just going to be too small. So now I'm going to take that same rubber band that came on the hair and just wrap it around my little bun. And I'm going to part the two pieces of hair um, to get apart, parting them apart. And um, I'm going to twist the sides of the hair. And then I'm going to twist the other side. And after this, I'm going to start wrapping it around my bun. And you'll see what I'm talking about in a second. Here we go. Excuse all the chattering I'm doing in the video. I'm jamming to some songs. So I'm just going to go ahead and wrap that around and try and get it as uniform looking as possible. Unless you like your buns to look messy, then go for it, girl. Shit. <laughs> At this ending point, you're going to want to go ahead and just mold it however you want and pin it. That's what I was doing. You're going to, oh, well, also put the next hairband around it so it stays put. And then that's when I go in with my pins and start pinning. Uh, you make sure when you're pinning your hair you do not want these pins to stick out honey that's not going to look cute at all <laughs> so make sure when you pin your hair that everything is in together Almost done guys, almost done. So any flyaways, you're just gonna wanna go ahead and tuck them in, make sure the hair looks really sleek. I'm going back in with my brush to just make sure I got everything. Here, I'm just gonna go ahead and take my shears and cut off any of loose hairs that's from the Kalankalon hair, not my own hair. Just making sure everything looks, you know, uniform. And now for the baby hairs. This step is optional. You definitely do not have to do this. I know a lot of people don't like to lay down hairs um, or baby hairs, whatever it is you want to call them. But, you know, if you want to, go for it. So now I'm going to go ahead in with my satin scarf and just, um, you know, wrap it around my head so that everything can be laid down and set really nicely. Um, you know, if you're going to go take a nap, you can do that. I really don't recommend it, really. I'm just going to wait with that on. And this is the final product, you guys. Um, if you all want to see how I got this look, please, please, please um, go ahead and just click the link in the description box or on top of the video. There will be an annotation somewhere in this video because I do have a tutorial on this makeup look. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye. Yeah.